Yo, peace. Lash in the guard. Let me build with y'all. Like, part in the camera. This is a new joint I got, but yo, let me build with y'all real quick. Like, look, a lot of times, um, hold up. Peace. Lash in the guard. But I want to build with y'all. Y'all know I got a channel called Keep Low, so tap in with the channel. It's K double E P slash uh oh. But yo, check it. Listen, just what I wanted to build with y'all about today. Look. When brothers, you know, first you dumb, deaf, and blind, right? And then, let me just say this. I want to give thanks to the Father of Allah for bringing the supreme mathematics, the supreme alphabet, and the 12 Jews of Islam to the table and incorporating it with 120 lessons. The 120 lessons is already there because that was W.D. Farrar asking the Honorable Elijah Muhammad questions and the Honorable Elijah Muhammad was answering the questions in the 120. That's in the message of the black man in different places, right? But check it. This, the thing, it used to have me bugging out when I was younger because I had knowledge since I was like knowledge culture, knowledge power. You know, I knew 120 since that time, right? That's 14, 15 for those who don't know. But check it. So I knew 120, my whole book of life. And we took pride in learning that because you had to bill in order to get your universal flag. You feel me, dig me? Now check it. I grew up in the era when I used to go to rallies in Fort Greene, Brooklyn. And if you ain't know your math, you know, brothers used to be passing out little physical justice for brothers not being in tune I've even personally been told myself, um, let me just pull over for a minute. I've even personally been told myself to, yo, God, yo, tighten your math up. Yo, last time I seen you, you was on the one to 14 lesson, the third degree. Yo, what up? You love this nation? Tighten your, tighten your math up, right? So now me getting my math tight, by being around strong individuals, still, still sharp and still, you feel me? So I started congregating with brothers. And once I started getting my math down pat, and it's between probably 13 and I mean, 14 and 15, really getting it right. So I used to run up and challenge brothers math. Like, you know, because as human beings, we're competitive by nature and i was a young bull you feel me dig me so i'm running up to the old wise bulls and i'm like what's good yo what's today's math and they bugging now i'm asking them so i'm telling you to tell you this right when the father incorporated supreme mathematics in the supreme alphabet and the 12 jews of islam with the 120 lessons that was a brilliant move because it helps you to really tap into your God self. You can do it with 120, but once you, the mathematics is everything, man. Trust me. And like, once you start to utilize them and become a master of your mathematics, you're unstoppable. You feel me? Now, this is what had me, like, brothers that say, a large God, right? Arm, leg, leg, arm, supreme head. And then again, you know, at the same time, that's in a physical form, but we know that a law of the mind, the soul control of all elements inside the circumference of 360 degrees, which is light, right? Because your mind made matter. If you were to cut my head open, you'll see my penal gland, my pituitary gland, which helps me tap in with my mind. You'll see my medulla abogata, my cerebrum and my cerebellum and the 12, you know, stages of the brain or whatever. But you won't see my mind. You feel me? Because the mind is the sole control of all elements. The mind made matter. The physical composition, which is your DNA structure, um, your physical composition is made of certain elements, but all that's physical, physical that makes your body one component. You feel me? But 
Allah is your supreme mind, which is your spiritual essence within yourself. You feel me? And it controls everything. That's the oneness. And what used to have me like bugging out when I was younger or just looking at dudes like they was weirdos and no disrespect to anybody, but this is me lashing the guard. You feel me? Um, brothers used to say, yo, they guard like I'm guard, right? And then they'll say some shit like, if a law lets me, like, what are you talking about? If a law lets you, you're a law, right? Don't forget because you're in a physical form in this third dimension that you're not the soul controller. You are the spiritual essence within your physical self. You feel me? That's what makes your physical self move and gives it energy. You are that supreme energy in here. You are the controller of everything. And that's what a law is, the mind, the controller of everything. So why would I have to go pray five times a day to myself when I'm already in tune with myself. I rest. I'm a law. When I wake up, I'm a law. And I don't just look at the physical being unique law, seem a law, this physical body right here. No, I'm just amplifying my spiritual essence through this physical body. I'm using this as a physical, this physical component as a tool to interpret things to y'all, to build things, to motivate people, to do different things like that, to show y'all the beauty of a law. Yo, just stay in tune with your mathematics, man. My name is Unique Lashim Law, understanding. And um, they call me Lashim the Guard. I got a channel called Keep Low. Yo, just tap in with the guard if you want to tap in with the true guard within yourself. And just utilize your full potential, man. Yo, I love all of y'all. I want to see y'all, Bill. Tap in with me. My channel name is Keep Low. That's K-E-E-P slash L-O. Go to www.keeplowproductions.com. Like the page. Um, Cop a shirt or something if you want. Rock out with the guard. Just tap in with me. I'll build y'all up, man. Peace.